Okay, we're moving on to the next method. We pulled the USB cable out, or USB flash drive out on the last video. And now we are gonna use the SD card. If you don't have it in there already, you can put it in. It should come with the camera. It's a little bitty thing. Um, gotta get it in there and then press it down. And it'll snap in, and then you're good to go. You will need to go into the menu. Don't forget to do this. Um, and tell it where you want to store. If you were still in where it was before and you were on USB flash drive and you tried to capture an image and you hit save, it'll tell you that it doesn't detect a flash drive. Um, so we need to go into the menu, settings, and we need to switch it to SD card. Done. And now we can take an image. Laser sharp autofocus. Hold up the number three. Snap the image. And hit save. Now we'll switch over to the computer and show you how you pull it out. I pulled the micro SD card out of the camera and then put it into my computer. I have uh, its own individual port, but if not, you're going to have to use some kind of connector to get it to connect to your PC. Once you connect it to the PC, you'll see it'll show up in your uh, drives and devices. Double click there, DCM, okay, and the one that was edited today. And let's see if we can, this one. This is the most recent one. So this is the one we're gonna take, and remember from before to get this where we want it, we are gonna need to get into this, um, make sure that we're in username and it's gonna remember in Fluke Connect Desktop it told us where we had to put it. So I created a new folder. Let's uh, call this SD card. I'll delete everything else out of that folder. I'm gonna grab the image that I care about, pull it over there. Now that it's in the folder, I can go into here and syncing files. If we switch views, switch back, I'm guessing it'll be there. And there it is, number three. So this is the third method that you can get it out using the micro SD card.